Hey everyone, welcome back to my channel. My name is Timmy Treacle, also known as Horror Fan for Life. And today I got a couple more movie reviews for you guys. The first one is called War Horse. And this was released on December 25th, 2011. It is a war drama film that has received positive reviews from critics. Uh, Cinema Score has an average grade of an A minus. It has a 7.2 out of 10 on IMDb. A 74% on Rotten Tomatoes and a 94% on Google. And uh, Roger Ebert of the Chicago Sun Times gave it three and a half out of four stars. Now, this movie had a $70 million budget. It made $177.6 million at the box office. And it was directed by the great Steven Spielberg and written by Lee Hall and Richard Curtis. And it's based on the 1982 novel of the same name by Michael uh, Borgos. Hope I'm pronouncing that correctly. Uh, the movie stars Benedict Cumberbatch, Tom Hiddleston, Jeremy Irvine, Emily Watson, and Peter uh, Mullen. Uh, this movie is about a guy named Albert who, whose family is struggling to pay their rent and produce any crops until they come across this horse where the father ends up actually overpaying for the horse uh, but has promised that if he gets this crop in that he would make good with uh, uh, landowners uh, then a hard rain hits Albert decides to enlist in uh, the army as World War One pops off uh, he loses uh, connection with this horse and that's the movie in a nutshell I had no idea that they still use horses uh, especially during World War one but as I watched the movie now I know what they use them for basically for muscle to move their big weapons and uh, things like that which is very interesting uh, but I, I love movies uh, set during wars uh, World War One, uh, crazy, crazy time. Uh, you know, I, I can't imagine what it would be like to serve as a young man. He was only uh, seventeen, I believe. Uh, but this movie is fantastic. I love the relationship you have with uh, a person and their animal, their pet. And horses are no different. They're uh, just, they're awesome to have. Uh, never personally owned one myself, but uh, it would it'd probably be a lot of fun to have uh, some horses around and whatnot. Uh, but this movie uh, received not only uh, positive reviews from critics, but it got some attention at the Oscars. It was nominated for six, including Best Picture. And it was also nominated for two Gold Globe Awards. Uh, but overall, I love the performances. Uh, Jeremy Irvine, who plays Albert, is fantastic. I'll even give it up to the horse. The horse in this movie is freaking awesome. Whoever trained this horse uh, did one hell of a job. Uh, and this was just a blast to watch. Uh, it was recommended by my dad, uh, Bill Treacle. Uh, for some reason, I, I don't know, uh, I must have lost it on my list or whatever, but I'm glad I got to watch it. It is a fantastic movie, as my father said, and I'm going to give it a 10 out of 10 and two thumbs up. Fantastic movie. So if you haven't seen War Horse, definitely check it out. In the comment section below, if you've seen it, give me your thoughts and opinions. And if you're new to the channel, don't forget to click the subscribe button, hit that notification bell, and if you like this review, hit that like button. But thanks again for watching. Stay tuned for my review of the film The Vanished, written and directed by Peter Fascinelli. But I thank you guys for watching, and check you later.